Prove It, a family workshop video from Springboard Collaborative. One way we see if children truly understand what they read is to ask them questions about the book and then to point to the words or phrases in the book that prove what they're saying is true. We call this reading tip Prove It because children are using the book to prove or show some examples and evidence for their thinking. It works like this. He was brought to a wildlife rehabilitation center before this happened. Okay, tell me what, can you sort of tell me what's happening here and what you got from here, what you understand from this so far? That they took him to this rehabilitation place so, because so why? he wouldn't attack other people in the neighborhood. Okay, and where, where do you see that sort of being said here in this part? Like, can you show me a sentence that kind of proves that that's what that was saying? A boy had been venturing so close areas where people lived and was attacking, attacking their dogs. Great. These, these, they, the behaviors help decide if and when these animals can go back, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So that means that they're not ready yet. Just like if um, a bird, sometimes birds have an injured wing or something, so we keep them inside until they're rehabilitated, until they're ready to go out again into nature. So they're not ready to go back into nature, these big cats, right? Why aren't they ready to go back into nature? What did the book say? What are conflict animals? Um, conflict animals. Well, show me. Find it in the book and show me what, so you find what it is again. So if you forgot, that's okay. Yeah. Yeah, here. So what is it again? Because of concerns that he would attack humans. Right. So they have to rehabilitate him, make him able to go back into the nature mm -hmm. um, and so that he won't attack um, humans. Okay. Face a higher risk than jaguars or leopards but are not yet consi considered endangered. So what are some of the things that they were saying in here that are like concerns for these, even though that they're really powerful predators, what were some of the concerns? What things could, could um, hurt these big cats? Humans. Mm-hmm, where did it say that? Here, uh. many threats, a lot of trade conflicts with humans and destruction of natural habitat. So, so the humans are destroying their habitat. Uh, the humans are destroying the habitat. Younger children can point to the picture that proves their thinking. Then together you can find the words on the page. By helping children prove or back up their ideas with examples and words from the book, we're helping them understand the story more completely. And soon, They'll be able to do it without our help.